morning it's barbara i forgot to do my gizmo again oh well <laughs> uh, just a quick outside probably for the last time in a couple of days because it's going to get rainy in fact it's going to start raining this afternoon dennis said we'll have to walk the dogs a little early today probably based on the radar but you know be outside while you can <sighs> Although we did not go outside too much yesterday. I mean, I was outside while the cleaners were doing the downstairs. We hung out with the, Dennis and I hung out with the dogs out here. But uh, once they were gone, we didn't come out where it wasn't in the mood. And so we didn't come out. I was reading, I was, um, Oh, I do like to make a little extra progress every time the cleaners come once a month. I try to, you know, like advance a little bit. And so yesterday I got my Goodwill stuff together, which has been sitting in the front hallway and uh, put it in the car and took it. So <laughs> Pete did not have to vacuum around my boxes. I took them and so while I was out I got avocado. Um, so we had an avocado with our taco salad and that was good. I went to Aldi's. Now I had been there once before I told you and I wasn't that impressed but it worked out great. I was able to find an avocado that was ripe so we could eat it right away and uh, got some salsa that uh, Dennis liked. So yeah. I mean, I didn't have a big shopping. I just had a couple things. But. So I did get out of the house yesterday. And we had a very nice walk. Because it was nice weather. Um, yeah. So the girls are out here with me. Hanging out on the deck. Dennis got a chance to mow a little bit yesterday. Just uh, some of the high places back here. The high places that don't have sticks because we haven't dealt with the sticks. But I did talk to Manny. I think he's coming tomorrow. Hopefully they'll take care of the sticks and we can talk about more work that I want to have done so that we have uh, make some progress on the outside too. That would be good. I did knit. Um, I tried to find the good doctor was recommended thank you for the recommendation um i wherever it is it's not on my tv that i could find and and i you know i told you yesterday i was feeling punk a little when i woke up and you know so i cocooned last night so aura and i were re-watching reruns of the great british bake-off now, I have seen the, these shows several times. She has only seen them once and is not remembering a lot of things lately. So she's enjoying them a lot. But I sat there and I knit. So I am at my ribbing at the bottom. Now, where's my... And that's how much I have knit since last you saw this. And so I have two days of knitting, maybe less. Three days, if I don't, you know. A, it's a lot, it's gotten really big. This is my fourth skein, sixth skein. This is how much I have left. These are my, <laughs> well, my ball bags. And uh, yeah, so there we go. I'm really excited about this with my turtleneck. So anyway, it'll be fun. It'll be fun to have. It's been a long time since I blocked anything, but I did find my blocking mats. I told you I, they were missing, but I did find them. Um, so I can, I can do that when the time comes. I probably, if I have the opportunity to wear it, I'm gonna wear it before I block it and then block it when I'm sure I, I won't need it anymore. That's my plan. I'm making plans. I do not know what my next project is gonna be though. So meanwhile today, 
I do not have any big plans, although Dennis has a new batch of clotted cream in the fridge, so I'm going to be making popovers because I like popovers with clotted cream and lemon curd uh, for dessert. So I will be making that. Everybody else can have them too. So a little bit of cooking. Popovers take 20 minutes. 25 minutes total. 20 of those is in the oven. <laughs> and yeah. Yeah. Not feeling very energetic. I am not sleeping well these days. Not sure what that's all about, but um, yeah. And I'm in a, you know, I'm in a little bit of a funk, which is a drag, but they, these funks come and go. <laughs> I'm expecting this one to leave soon. <laughs> I'm looking at that picture that I have the background for, trying to figure out what exactly I want to do with that. And it's kind of interesting. Maybe I'll sketch something up. There's a bee circling Maisie. She's laying right there and she's watching it. She's going back and forth. It's like, what is this? Don't bite at it. <laughs> might be a pollinator uh, anyway so I'm thinking about my picture I'm gonna be knitting I started a book I don't know how I feel about the book I didn't finish it I watch TV instead and knit for a while and then just watch TV so see how things go meanwhile yeah oh here's the thing it's coming around me now um, yeah, I'm expecting a quiet day, rainy afternoon. It's going to be rainy tomorrow. Um, tomorrow morning, before I even talk to you, I have to take Maisie in for her. Um, yep, yeah, see that bee? Eh, or a wasp, I'm not sure. Take Maisie in for her grooming, so she will come back. She will come back all shaved. Seems like it's too big for a honeybee. So it's probably a wasp. So now I gotta keep an eye out to make sure it's not going in somewhere at the house. We had a wasp infestation. I don't think it was last summer. I think it was the summer before. Summer before. So now we have a pesticide place on, you know, retainer not my favorite thing but wasps in the house are a big no-no for me I have to say okay <clears throat> ramble ramble I'm just gonna be hanging out today so I won't have anything to talk about tomorrow either <laughs> but I did enjoy working on my Cory Inn which is the poncho and uh, yeah And I'm expecting a quiet, lovely day. Dennis and I were just sitting talking and, you know. Yeah. Oh, we do have to talk to Manny about our gate. Dennis mowed a little bit, so he had to open the big gate. And we hadn't really opened it before. And the one, the one, um, it's a two-part gate. Like this. And one of them goes all the way back and one of them does not because it hits the ground because the ground isn't level there. So Manny's going to have to make an adjustment to the gate so that it'll open all the way. But yeah, I think he's coming tomorrow, so that would be good. Probably coming tomorrow because it's going to be rainy and they won't be able to do their work, whatever their work is. So yeah, I'm watching that wasp. It's not huge, but I don't think it's honeybee. There was no reason for a honeybee to be around where it is, so anyway, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> please take good care of yourselves. Please, please, please stay safe and stay sane.